Well, hi and welcome. Today we're at Virginia State University's Randolph Farm and we're going to be talking about cold frames. Now, what is a cold frame? A cold frame is basically just a structure that you can use in your garden to extend your growing season. It's something that you might have uh, earlier in the spring to put transplants in to harden them off or maybe to have um, plants growing. It might be something that you might have in the fall or even all the way through the winter time. And it might look a lot like this. It's just something that you might build that's got a, a top on it that lets light uh, come through so you can grow your plants. And this is one that I put together pretty quick. It's made out of mostly just uh, re repurposed materials. Uh, there's a pallet material here. This is just where a pallet's been taken apart and just used that lumber. There's some uh, old decking boards that are up there that somebody gave me that we've used. Uh, some, some old plywood type material here. And then this is just a, uh, a storm window, something that, uh, that we had laying around, wasn't being used anymore. And it's really nice for a structure like this. And you can actually just quite you just open it up pretty easily. So this is what you would use to ventilate the structure. You just uh, open it up like this or close it uh, when it gets too, uh, too cold out. So let me finish putting this together and then we'll show you how you would actually use this in the field. One of the things you want to do is make sure when you're siding this to face it south. That way you get maximum sunlight, especially in the, in the colder part of the year. Also, you want a little bit of an angle on your cold frame with the glass, the top part anyway, uh, so that uh, you get maximum sunlight, but you also have things like rain and snow will kind of roll off there. So once you've got this built, then you've got to, to put your plants in there and you have to think about management. On a, on a cloudy day like today, it's in the 40s, um, this would mostly be closed all day long to, to make sure that the plants uh, are okay. But if it's bright outside, if there's any sun, even on a cold day, you want to vent this. You know, and this one just, you just move the window and close it. Others, you would do it in, in different ways. Well, especially in the springtime, as you're thinking about putting your transplants out into the garden, you might want to harden them off first. Get them out in the cold weather and the wind and the sunlight and make sure that they're ready for the garden. And one of the things ways you can do that is put it in the cold frame, uh, keep them warm at night. Um, and one of the ways you can kind of keep this warm, other than just closing and opening the, the vents, you could add maybe insulation board, something like this that you could put uh, in here, line the box with it and maybe even a little bit into the ground to kind of keep it a little warm. Another way you can do that is um, maybe with a, a milk jug, painting it black, putting water in it, putting a few of these in here. As they absorb heat during the day, it'll release that heat during night and, and maybe keep it a little warmer in there. Well, for more information about how to build one of these or really how to manage a uh, cold frame, contact your local county extension office and talk to a master gardener. For From the Ground Up, I'm Chris Mullins. I'll see you next time. From the Ground Up is presented with the generous advice and assistance of Virginia Cooperative Extension. Visit their website at ext.vt.edu.